seven games is happening right here. Hi, it's easy to get to. It's a small stadium atmosphere, so you can really experience the sort of overall activities and see the game and feel close. Go down on the field at the end, so it's nice that it's a small, intimate stadium. I think the energy in the town has been good, and I think the food has been really good as well. The best thing about the games is probably the atmosphere and the people. Everybody's super chill and super nice, and it's just great to be around all these people that enjoy the same thing as you. It's been great. A lot of camaraderie between uh, North Dakota and JMU, and it's, uh, it's been fun. So it's a good mix. Uh, transportation's been great. Uh, accommodations have been great. Outfit here is tremendous. Uh, I love it. I love it. It's, uh, it's a good atmosphere. The stadium's getting nicer all the time, and uh, I think it'll be good. Uh, I mean, Frisco's a great host. We, uh, we're fortunate we have friends who live down here, but I mean, the game day environment, everything that's around here. Last night, the pep rally was awesome. Everything that the Cowboys do to open up things for the, for the fans was great. It's been great. You walk around the tailgate lots, it's completely packed. It's just a great atmosphere, so I wouldn't change a thing there. The tailgate town would be nice to have it where it used to be, but that's just my two cents. I would say I like best just the, the overall uh, location is good. Uh, the support of the community is good. Uh, just the overall fan experience. Um, all of the extras that they have for the kids, and the atmospheres, and the walk with the teams, and things like that. I enjoy the atmosphere. I enjoy coming and having the face painted, the different um, activities to do, I think that's a great experience and a, a great um, kind of team builder. It's everything outside the stadium, especially this year with the two fan bases that we have. It's unbelievable. Everyone, no one's me. Everyone's together. We're all here for the experience, the community for it all. And I think that's the best part of it, no matter the outcome. Actually mingling with the fans from the other team and just having a good time. It's a celebration. Both teams are here. A lot of the schools would love to be here. And uh, it's, a, it's just fun. Frisco's a beautiful city. We enjoy Frisco when we come down here and all the pregame entertainment. The only thing I don't like this year is that they wouldn't let us set up the motorhomes the night before on Friday like we normally did because obviously somebody messed it up last year for us. But. It's just a, a great college atmosphere. I mean, to see two teams from North Dakota and Virginia to come all the way to Frisco, Texas, it, it's, it's amazing. I mean, they're really, really having a good time. This is the best year I've seen. JMU has brought a really good fan base. North Dakota State brings a really good fan base. Uh, it's been great from both sides. And the city of Frisco has been very accommodating to us. They're very, very accommodating. Just about right. Um, I definitely don't think it's over commercialized. There could be a little room for more. Uh, I think it should be more commercialized, honestly, because this is still Division One right here. It's a it's a level below FBS, but I mean it's still D1. There's some guys going to the NFL every year. You know, it should it should be equal. They should have more advertising. They should be on TV a little bit more. The student athletes at FCS to be able to enjoy something like this. I think you have to have some level of sponsorship to make it happen. Maybe, you know, what's going to happen Monday night in Alabama and, and Georgia playing, maybe that's a little bit overkill, but not here. I think it's about normal, what you should expect. I mean, uh, you can't happen without corporate sponsorship, and you got to expect this kind of exposure. In a way, it's over-commercialized. I don't know if they need to do any more, uh, but it is nice to have those sponsorships there. It's not over-commercialized. So it's not over-commercialized. Marketing is the way to success. I think marketing, these companies marketing their merchandise and their, their brand is important. Um, whether it be Toyota or Marriott or what have you, um, I think that they all, this is part of the uh, business of the game. <laughs> 
I think it's the perfect spot where it's at. I mean, commercialization is what this, what it's all about in our like for everyone. You know, it, the only way to get it out to the masses is to have people backing it up. And if we didn't have sponsors, this wouldn't be on ESPN or anything because it's a lower level game. And I think it's I think it's the perfect perfect spot where it's at. I think it's good. I mean, you know, it's not like they're trying, everybody's trying to sell you something. It's I mean, you, you see, uh, you know, obviously Toyota Stadium, they got their spots. And, you know, Pizza Hut, things like that. But I mean, you know, it's it, they have to put it on. We understand that, but it's it's not like everybody's trying to sell you something. Well, it's all over commercialized, you know. But that's just part of it. You know, it's so I mean, I'll say it's just right. It's fine. A lot of money to put these things on. You know, it's only a twenty thousand person venue. You got to make your money somehow. I mean, they're you know they're helping the whole experience. So yeah. Putting on this game, um, I think the hype around it is good. I try to work with ESPN to get the. I don't know how much power they have with this, but I try to get this game since it's such a big game. Obviously, it's too late now, but in the future, a game of this magnitude between these two teams and the SCS, I think it should be in prime time. I would tell the NCAA keep it up. It's going really good. Uh, Frisco is a great place to have this game. Uh, the weather's a lot better than in Fargo, North Dakota. And uh, it's always a blast. I can tell the NCAA one thing. Um, it's a tough question. Always, always remember the student athletes first. Put them first. Sell all the seats to North Dakota State fans. One year they had a special camp for kids, like a football camp. Uh, they haven't had it since, but when they had that, that was incredible. The kids had a blast. It was right out in the soccer area over here, and they loved it. Uh, I think to make it better, the, the uh, interaction with some of the past players is, is always nice. You have a chance to meet them. Uh, any other type of corporate events where they're giving out, uh, maybe marketing materials is good. Uh, just more stuff for the kids to do. Okay. Always make it about the fans. You know, always make it about the entertainment. You know, make make it an event. You know, people come down here, spend a lot of money, spend a few days, have a good time, get away from work for a while, and, and enjoy it. To see this many people from so far away to enjoy the experience, everybody's high fiving each other. Whether it's whether you're North, you know North Dakota State or Dave Madison, everybody's just ready for the event. It's awesome. The only thing I will say at Toyota Stadium is, hey, it's awesome, but. If they did a little research on what the product is that's coming in, I mean, whether it's NDSU, JMU, or another team coming in, do a little research and find out what their tailgating experience they would like to see. Um, I understand there was a little problem last night, but they rectified it, which was a good deal. I preferred the, the MC from years one, two, and three when we came, and it would be nice if they had a few more seats, but the Frisco area has treated us very well. The video board is poor. It could be better. Uh, the stadium, we really like the stadium. I, I think it's a very nice stadium. Could have a few more seats. Could be a little bigger. Bigger and better clarity. I, I would agree that the clarity, especially on the replays, it's been a little bit hard to see the replays in the first half. But I think they do a good job of bringing what both teams do at their home stadiums. You know, the first down calls, that kind of thing. I think they do a real good job of supporting both sides. You know, it is what you make it, man. It's not, it's not up to the NCAA to make sure I have a good time. It's up to me. So, I, you know, I, they're doing a fine job here. I, you know, we appreciate it.